I'm smooth yet sinister Coming through to diminish ya And this here's the finisher <laughs> Check it out uh. What's going on guys? Trey coming back to your screen by means of the World Wide Web And today uh, we had a little bit of an update today guys So uh, pretty cool stuff um, the coolest thing about it is, to my knowledge, we didn't uh, have any maintenance schedule. I don't remember them really taking the game down. So, uh, if that's the case, bravo on Gloomy's part. Give them a round of applause for that one. Uh, looks like they're starting to push updates live. And uh, it was another map, so it was definitely not a small update, guys. Um, they also uh, pushed the new Rare Summit batch out the same day. So, uh, they did a lot today. So what I'm going to do guys is basically break down the uh, update, uh, what was uh, added to the game here. So uh, one of the most important things that was added is more quest mode maps. We got the uh, Tharva region now. So uh, if you've already completed Vrixa and uh, defeated the boss there, you now have the opportunity to start exploring a Tharva. So uh, make sure you get right to it guys. Uh, new maps, new gems and everything else to be acquired. All right? Now, along with this. Um, we got some new spheres, alright? So you can level up the sphere house in town now. It goes up another six levels now. I think it maxed out at level 50 before the update. And now with the update, it maxes out at level 56, I believe. So uh, if you got 80 million karma like me, you could uh, use something to spend it on. So just go uh, dump it into the sphere house, max it out, be done with it. Um, this, the spheres that you get, uh, here's a list of them nothing really too great honestly um, some of the spheres boost the stat by 40 percent some of the spheres do status ailments um, nothing honestly that uh, you're really going to be using on any of your units but might as well do it if you got the karma which I'm sure most of you guys do because karma just goes <laughs> it, there comes a point where you hardly have to use it uh, nowadays in global guys so um, just go dump it into the sphere house, level it up, you'll be fine, alright? So, um, here's another sweet thing, and they tell you right here in the news, after you complete the Atharva region, guys, you defeated the boss of the final area in the Atharva region, you get another one of those side quests, you know those dungeons with the red box, um, like Sea King orders Derva? Yeah, they got another one of those in the Atharva region, guys, so we got another tough boss coming. I'll definitely be expecting a video on that once I get the Atharva region wrapped up, um, which I've kind of been working on throughout the day. I've been really busy today, um, hence the reason I've been bringing videos kind of late. But uh, got in some time to record, some time to do some work on Brave Frontier. So uh, we are definitely going to have that recorded for you guys soon. All right, when you complete it, you get one Sphere Frog and one Gem, just like all the other uh, side dungeons. All right, so uh, Atharva region up for grabs um, just go show you guys real quick when you pop in here scroll on down and there it is a Tharva alright so you gotta finish Vrixia first make sure you go into Vrixia and you've beaten the last boss up here in the wolf slayer once you defeat that boss you'll, you'll automatically as soon as you pop in quest mode unlock the Tharva region so uh, I'm not super far yet I just uh kind of been in and out of it because like I said I've been kind of busy today but uh we'll get it done soon don't you guys worry we'll get it done real soon so uh that's the new area and then what I was telling you about earlier let's pop on over into town and then you go to your upgrades and the sphere house right here it gained levels as you can see I, I've already maxed it out again so uh, it's done. I've unlocked all the spheres already. That's the only thing that uh, leveled up more. Everything else is pretty much still the same level. So it unlocks some new spheres. So you can see over here I got spheres lit up new. But I unlocked a bunch of new spheres. Nothing, like I said, nothing you're really going to be using. But just to have it unlocked, I guess. Um, here's one of them, the Carnage Edge. I picked the wrong one. To show you guys real quick one of the uh, spheres here right here carnage edge boost attack by 40 percent so this was one of the new spheres if I so choose I could make one of them but um, I don't really see no reason to right now I don't know if maybe I need to make that in order to make a better sphere I, I'm not quite sure yet but in the meantime I'm not gonna worry about it but uh, 
all those 40% shields and then you got all kind of a status ailment spheres and all kind of stuff that came out today so uh, pick that stuff up if you can alright and uh, let's see I th think that was pretty much it um, in the same update they pushed out the new rare summon batch which I'm sure you guys all know about um, by now so uh, three gem summons guys uh, may want to take part in that just take note once again there's no rate increase on the new units for this guys so it's a discounted price but Gumi ain't gonna give it all to you alright you gotta just take what you can get with these rare summons so uh, they push that out new units release same day as the new map release pretty good stuff there and um another thing they did today um via the update is they pushed out the six star versions of the um the Sybil sisters all right so the Gumi did a lot today they did a lot today guys so uh, this is what what's pretty much new in the game right now so if you've got the Sybil sisters um you can now upgrade in the six star this is critical for free to play players guys because um if you're a free to play player and you don't really have many strong units right now I hope you were able to capture the Sybil Sisters uh, back when the dungeons were released here recently because you can evolve them up to 6 star and they're actually very good for free to play players alright um, they'll do you a lot of good if you don't have a lot of strong units by now alright so uh, make sure you go uh, do some uh, work on that, that alright and uh, other than that I think that pretty much wraps it up I don't think there's anything new over here I don't know why that's lit up I got the green minutes done but uh yeah nothing new in Randall to my knowledge guys so uh that's pretty much it for the new update just a video to let you guys know what took place in case there's something you may have overlooked or maybe something that's undiscovered to you right now I put this video out to help you out all right so I hope it did um, if you missed something hopefully this video was able to help you all right so that's gonna wrap this one up guys thank you for watching Please continue to like, subscribe, favorite, share, comment, and everything else. And also, if you wish to join the Facebook group, link down below in the description. All right? So I will be back to you guys with more Brave Frontier Global soon. Later, guys.